morning everyone i hope you're all well today's tuesday the 30th yes i think yeah of march yeah it's meant to be a gloriously sunny day today i was going to get up early and go for a nice long walk before i started work and i looked outside and it was cloudy and foggy and i was like what is this so i stayed in bed and now the sun is shining but it's a packaging day so as always, I will try and get these done quickly so then I can go outside, but who knows? I have a giant hole in this t-shirt. I need to mend it. Uh, so sorry if you just saw the giant hole. Clink. I've tried something different with my eyeshadow today. I don't know how I feel about it. I've just put it in the inner corner, pop a yellow to go with the earrings. Woo! New earrings from Kawaii Studios. I got, they arrived yesterday. I wore them all day yesterday and wearing them today. Um, and yeah, it's packaging day. I was going to do a Sunday and then I woke up Sunday. I was like, you know what? I just want a day off. So I let myself have a day off. And then I kind of almost had a day off yesterday as well. So I am going to, I need to put all the findings on the stitch markers. I still need to label all the yarn and then packaging. It's currently quarter to nine. So we've not got off to too late of a start. And uh, yeah. Go put some metal on some bead things. stitch markers boop, boop. Um, I need to take them upstairs and I need to sort them just quickly charging my Chromecast so I can take that upstairs and yeah filmed a quick Instagram story to let people know who haven't who don't watch the vlogs that um, there's no shop update in April um, but yeah I'm still doing clubs clubs are still going on sale on the 1st of April and I'm still doing uh, advent calendars but I'm just not doing like a regular regular old shop update so yeah hoping that the break and like the lack of pressure will open up the creativity of the brain and will uh spur me on to dye more yarn so that's that's the goal um but I do also need to dye up a fair few sweaters quantities and that is like this week's job maybe Mary is off on Thursday, so I won't do it Thursday. Mary is out all day Saturday, so I might do it Saturday. I could get a lot done on Saturday, so who knows? But I really want to get outside at some point. Wish I'd got up and gone this morning. I knew I'd, I knew I'd regret not going. I knew it, so I don't know why I didn't go. But um, yeah, I do need to package now because it's already 10 o'clock because I've just been sitting. Queen of procrastination, hello, party for one. satisfying they all fit in one tray so I can pop this one away oh you're on top of my stand excuse me um I do still have some stitch markers made as like stock stitch markers but I'm thinking let's do this real quick I'm thinking of um making some more to put back in them to like refill them for a bit 
in case I do end up doing any shows or in case I do have a few months where I don't have time to make as many stitch markers or something I can always dip into them because um, yeah they're useful to have especially as stuff opens up more like and just take this month where stuff still isn't open um, to do more um, what am I trying to say to make to basically do more like prep prep stuff shop prep Ooh, it's cold up here oh i might have to put a jumper on but yeah i need to take an ink cartridge downstairs i use the kaveco ink cartridges i don't i mean i also have loads of these cheap ones but kaveco black ones are really good um they're a german german brand hence the weird pronunciation and yeah, cool. I have some tissue paper cut. I might cut some more. I have some bubble wrap cut, but I need to cut some more. I've still got loads of cards prepped, so that's one thing less to do. That needs to go in the bin. Ooh, this needs to tidy up. But yes, I'm hoping I got, basically the thing that I can't really talk to you about, I'm just gonna talk to you about it. Um, I got a desk, so I'm going to be not here anymore. I think I'm going to be over there because it's a standing desk. But, um, or like it's an adjustable desk that I could also stand or sit at. So this desk will be going downstairs and then I'll be having the standing desk. I think it's gonna go here. You can't really see it. Um, it's where I was gonna put the grid wall, but I don't think the grid wall's gonna fit here. So I don't know what this little corner is going to be. I guess it could be my podcasting corner. Like put the chair here, put some pictures behind. I don't know, it's got pretty good lighting. So I could have it as the podcasting corner. I'll have a think but yeah I'm hoping a standing desk will make packaging much easier so I'm not so I'm just like standing the whole time while I'm doing it instead of up and down up and down because um I'm relatively tall I'm like five seven ish and being stood at a regular table or desk is just actually um a little bit sore on the back if I was a tiny bit shorter it would be much better but that's why a lot of kitchen counters are a bit taller because you kind of want it to be at your waist um, and that's what I'm hoping the standing table will be good for. So, fingers crossed. Um, right. Here are some yarn labels. I think I need some more printing. Sparkle sock I don't need because I didn't dye any. Sturdy sock sets I don't need because I didn't dye any. I've got a few merino and I need to make a new label for fluffy lace. So, I should probably go get my... Uh, Chromebook because that's still downstairs and put a jumper on I was I was expecting it to be really hot up here but it's actually quite delightful
So I'm packaging, oh, I put Cardi on. Did we discuss this? I'm wearing my fluff nugget. I can't remember if I addressed it. Anyway, um, I have started packaging. It is underway. One page done. Yeah, fluff. Joys of the fluff nugget. Um, but I'm pretty hungry, so I'm going to go get some lunch. I am watching Critical Role, the latest episode that's just come out on YouTube. And uh, yeah, it's pretty t pretty tense. I'm very much enjoying it though. I don't know what's going to happen, but I look forward to finding out. And yeah, one page down, only 12 to go actually. So it's not actually that, it's not that bad. I was worried that it would be um, loads, but it's actually like a really nice manageable amount of orders to package so thank you everyone uh yeah right lunch time lunch time we had a barbecue yesterday because the sun is out and we're british and therefore we must get the barbecue out grilling is that what you call it in north america we call it barbecuing i know in the south of the states barbecuing is very serious and very different and involves a long time of smoking we hope to embrace that at some point when we eventually are able to get gas for our new gas barbecue because there are no gas canisters anywhere so they're not giving any new ones out so that's really annoying so we can't actually get gas for the new barbecue so we used our old charcoal barbecue because who needs one barbecue when you have two um and yeah we barbecued yesterday so i have some leftover barbecued salmon we've got some salad and some uh, like roasted vegetable couscous that I was going to say we made, Mario made, and yes, I might whip out some feta and have some feta with it. It will be delightful. So the cardi is off, getting a bit toasty. This is why it turns out this room is going to be a morning packaging room because otherwise it's going to get way too hot in here. I need to be sure to remember that when I'm packaging later. Oh God, sorry, didn't mean to. You're, you're not stable at all. Let me just adjust that leg and then do one of these. Is that better? hopefully um yeah so i need to remember that if i'm going to package in the summer the joys of new rooms you find out new things all the time these windows do open but they're a bit of a bitch to close uh sorry that was a most unpleasant expression um a bit of a pain to close they're a bit stiff and yeah but it was quite cool this morning verging on cold so i need to try to remember that and try and like do packaging stuff early in the a.m. rather than fart around all morning and then start just before lunchtime because yeah I haven't got outside once today and the weather is glorious and I'm in here not even looking out the window uh, which is my bad completely but hopefully I can do something tomorrow depending what time the postman comes to collect all your orders because I'm pretty sure I'm just going to get all these done today I was because how I have started to reason with myself it's a dangerous thing don't just start reasoning with yourself just tell yourself to do it um 
is saying that oh it's fine I'll just do half if I just do half then that's okay but the joys of just doing half means that now I'm doing it I may as well just finish because it wasn't even that many you heard me say how many there were it wasn't that that much uh, that one so I'm just going to keep going and plow on through um, yes, Critical Role going very well, still currently listening to, well, obviously not right this second, um, because I'm talking to you. Oh my goodness, on the customs label I almost said that it was 2031. It's because it's the 30th of the 3rd, 30th of the 3rd, and then I want to write another 3, there's not another 3, um, but yeah. I'm still just packaging. I've run out of tea, as I was worried I would be. I've ordered some more. Um, I ordered them yesterday. Hopefully they'll be shipped out today, but I don't have them here right now. So, you know, you gotta do what you can with what you've got. Right, I'm just gonna keep going with this. And um, I'll chat to you in a bit because my camera's now low battery because I've been filming myself doing things, so. And that is the last order packaged. If you've not watched my videos before, hello. Um, I'm in what is meant to be a bedroom, but you're not allowed to use it as a bedroom because it's a dodgy loft conversion. Um, but they put a bathroom in, so that's why there's a bathroom in my office and it doesn't have a door on, so I can't close it. It is now five to four. Oh, that's taken me all day. They always take me all day to do. There wasn't even that many orders, um, but it is done. I will call Royal Mail tomorrow and have them come and collect it. And yeah, I should go outside and make the most of the sunshine and go for a bit of a walk. Um, text Mario before I go so he doesn't come home and get confused as to why I'm not home. So I changed my mind. I may regret that decision, but I'm currently just staying in. I might go for like a after dinner walk, or quite like an, a later evening walk. Before it gets dark, I do not feel safe going out if it's dark. But um, yeah. And plus I then just kind of power walk because I have all the energy from the food. Um, and then I sleep really well. But for right now, I'm feeling a bit tired. So it's time for a tea. So let's go make a cup of tea. Hey folks, it's really sunny. Uh, Mario came home, had a very tasty dinner. We made stir fry with like seafood in it. It was good, it was good. And now I've gone out for an evening stroll while the sun is out. Um, it's not as hot as it was earlier, which is nice, but still cardi free. I think I might either. I mean, I can't throw this t-shirt out, I should. Mario, I said, showed Mario the hole in the armpit. He said, I think you need to throw that out. I'm like, well, yeah, I do, but. I don't really want to, <laughs> so I might attempt to repair it and give it new life for a bit longer. Or we'll cut the sleeves off is another option, but uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. It's nice to get out in the sunshine. Um, I am in boots, which might be a mistake, but you know, I don't really want to wear my running shoes. They're not the most comfortable for walking in, which is weird. Pretty, good. They're fine for running, but walking, I'm like, ooh. I feel weird, but yeah, just a bit of a stroll around, listening to the darkness in the sunshine. Um, I'm still stuck on that Easter is cancelled album. I, I do this, I get through phases of like obsessively listening to albums and then I move on. That's the one I currently obsessively listening to. Hopefully I'll move on soon, but yeah, evening stroll. Hi. Oh, yo. 
are beautiful and very soft. ultimate cat watch. <laughs> I actually got to stroke the cat. Ah, how cute. I've seen that cat a couple of mornings on my run because um, I just come down this way and it's beautiful. I don't know what flavour of cat they are but it reminds me a little bit of Becky's cat Keaton. Keaton. I was gonna say it's much cuter but all cats are cute but you know what, you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, absolutely adorable. Well, that walk was delightful. Um, yeah, the sun was setting so the light was really nice and I mean it's just a walking route that I've done so many times before. It's not new and exciting anymore but I did get to stroke a cat so that did make it new and exciting. And it's an extra 5,000 steps I probably wouldn't have done had I not left the house so, you know, even though I've barely done any steps today. Anyway, rather productive day in regards to um, packaging and the like. My eye has gone twitchy telling Mary about the cat I stroked and then I started coughing a lot because I got too excited now my eye is twitching oh my goodness um but yeah I'm just gonna round it off here because I don't really have a whole lot else to show you I'm probably going to knit on my jumper for a bit more and uh, probably have another tea at some point and then yeah to bed ready for tomorrow's run and shenanigans so if you'd like to follow me on social media, please feel free. Links, as always, can be found in the description box below, along with any other information that I think you might need. If you'd like to follow me on social media, did I just say that? They're down there. Links. Yes. Um, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you have been up to. I feel like it's been ages since I've spoken to you last. The vloggy check-in. We love to see it. Um, yeah, what projects are you working on? Let's have a natter. If you'd like to subscribe, that would be great. Currently posting three times a week. So I would have to love to have you along for the ride. That is the Corner of Craft party bus, if you will. Um, we'd love to have you join us. That would be delightful. Turn your notifications on if you want. And yeah, with all that being said, thank you so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. And I will see you very soon in Friday's video. Bye. <laughs>